Unveiling the Science. Can Precum Contain Sperm? Hello, and welcome to today's topic, where we will delve into the science behind a frequently asked question. Can Precum Contain Sperm? And is it possible to test for it? It's a topic that often comes up in discussions about reproductive health, and there are a lot of myths and misconceptions. So, let's get to it. What is Precum? First, let's start with the basics. What is Precum? Precum, also known as pre-ejaculate, is a clear, colorless fluid that is released from the penis during sexual arousal but before ejaculation. This fluid is produced by the Cowper's glands, also known as bulbarethral glands. Does Precum contain sperm? Now, moving on to our main question. Does Precum contain sperm? The answer is, sometimes, but not always. Precum itself does not contain sperm. However, if a man has recently ejaculated, some sperm might remain in the urethra and could be mixed with precum. This is why there is a slight chance of pregnancy even with withdrawal or pull-out method. Can you test for sperm in precum? This brings us to our next question. Can you test for sperm in precum? Yes, it is technically possible to test for the presence of sperm in precum. The process would involve collecting a sample of the fluid and examining it under a microscope. However, this isn't a common or practical practice in most settings, and the concentration of sperm, if present, would typically be quite low compared to a full ejaculation. What does this mean for birth control? So, what does this mean for birth control? The presence of sperm in precum underscores the importance of using reliable forms of contraception. Even though the chances of pregnancy from precum are much lower than from full ejaculation, there's still a risk. So, relying on the pull-out method or timing intercourse to avoid pregnancy can still lead to unintended pregnancies. And that wraps up our discussion on the possibility of sperm in precum. We hope that this video has given you a better understanding of the science behind this common question. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you understand about reproductive health, the better decisions you can make. Thanks for watching and stay curious.